After six days off, Notre Dame was back on the floor tonight looking to start another winning streak. Notre Dame hosting Stony Brook at Purcell Pavilion, a tournament caliber team out of the American East. And the Irish had a very efficient night on the offensive end. First half, V.J. Beecham knocks down the corner three, one of four that V.J. hit from long range. Usually Demetrius Jackson hands out the assist, but the beneficiary of a nice pass from Steve Asturia here, that put the Irish up by seven. And you don't see Zach August drive from the top of the key too often, but I don't mind seeing this. The big fella throws it down. He had a big night, 23 points, 10 rebounds. Notre Dame led by eight at halftime. They start to flex the muscles in the second half with the big guy watching in the crowd. Jackson picks off the pass, takes it in for the two-handed slam. Demetrius had 19 points tonight, and he also had a career-high 10 assists, none finer than this one coming up right here to a cutting Steve Asturia for the layup. Notre Dame gets the win tonight by a count of 86 to 61. So the Fighting Irish improved to 6 and 2 on the season. And WSBT 22's Carl Deffenball was at the basketball game tonight and joins us now courtside at Purcell Pavilion. Carl, you had a chance to speak from the Irish. I'd imagine the mood is pretty good tonight. Pretty good and pretty festive, actually, Pete. The students were wearing ugly sweaters in the student section. Mike Bray actually celebrated with Santa Claus after the win here tonight. But it was Demetrius Jackson who was giving away the gifts. A career-high 10 assists for DJ. And after the game, Bray paid Jackson a, a very high compliment. Said he's starting to run the show here, run the building like Jaron Grant used to. That's what happens when you're in your third year in the program and the main man running the offense for the Irish. As for Jackson, we just got out of the locker room. He said this is a fun way to play when the Irish are being aggressive and sharing the ball like they were tonight. Certainly fun as they turned what was supposed to be a, a key non-conference test before the final exam week into a 25-point blowout. Pete? And no doubt a very stress-free win for the Irish and good to see you again. That's Carl Deppenball live at Brazil Pavilion.